Well, I have gone over most of season two and three and will give my opinion on if there was any improvement, changes, as well as thoughts on the voices of the newer characters, particularly the GOAT Saints. First thing I want to do is say they have improved on the lip syncing. It's no longer a problem, which I am glad to see. But something I forgot to mention about the dub and likely sub in talking about the dialogue in my last video is the amount of cursing, which overall is fine and can make for some amusing moments, which I think they were going for, but I can see some people being put off by it. I noticed they have kept some themes going that were I believe only mentioned once like the saints being prejudiced against Japanese when I think it was not really brought up again originally. And again on the dialogue while I have no real glaring issues with it I do hope there are no important changes when it comes to lore detail. Luckily I have watched the fight with Leo detailing his faster than light movement so so far it's all good. The newer enemies like the Hercules Saint and the Silver Saints their voices are all fine. I found nothing that stood out personally. All the voices are serviceable even if it felt like variations of Johnny Young Bosch's voice. But the voices that people most care about are the Goat Saints. The best or at least most interesting voice I've heard so far is Death Mask. The voice actor sounds like he's having a lot of fun doing the type of posh royal British accent which is a bit odd for an Italian character, but I still grew to enjoy it. Aiello's, Milio, Moo, the voices are all fine and about what you would expect. Aeolia is mediocre at best, unfortunately. But while I could be biased because he is my favorite goat saint, but in my opinion, Virgo Shaka's voice is terrible, or at least very, very unfitting. It does not sound like the voice from Knights of the Zodiac either. I said to others, it sounds like they got the most boris thuggish guy they could find and told him to sound enlightened a friend of mine said he sounded like a guy that found religion in prison even the way he said his technique own was sad and weird now there's a 20 percent chance shaka voice would grow on me or get better but for now i think it just kind of odd while i have a take what i can get approach when it comes to content for saint share in the u.s I truly hope they change it. Anyway, that's my thoughts. Aside from some glaring things here and there, it was fine. Happy they fixed the lip syncing issue and can't wait for more. If I was to score it, I would give it about a B. But please, if anyone from the dub is watching this, please fix Shaka's voice. Well, that's it for now. Please check out Saint Seiya on Netflix. Link below. And remember to like and subscribe. <laughs>